Spain's already high unemployment rate inched higher in the final three months of last year, even as the economy picked up. The number of people out of work fell at the end of 2013 from a year earlier, but more than a quarter of a million people left the workforce during the year, meaning the jobless rate rose slightly. This woman said, my brother got a job in December after being unemployed for three years, but 40% of work contracts in December were temporary. I'm out of work too. People are definitely not seeing any improvement. Even as many long-term unemployed have given up looking for work, the overall jobless rate rose from just below to just above 26% of the workforce. More than 55% of young Spaniards are on the dole. This analyst was upbeat, though, saying, we believe we're going through a stabilisation process in the jobless numbers. Yes, there are still close to 6 million people out of work, but even so, we see signs of improvement. We think there will be net job creation this year, and it'll be a good year for job creation. Spain's central bank also believes the economic recovery is gaining traction. It thinks gross domestic product rose 0.3% on a quarterly basis between October and December. The Madrid government is forecasting growth of 0.7% this year. Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy has pledged households will soon feel the effects of the turnaround. This all comes as Spain formally exited a bank bailout programme under which it got a 41 billion euro loan from its European partners. However, bank assets continue to deteriorate with an increase in the number of loans not being paid back.